Hey everyone, Skull902 here. Today I'm going to be showing you how you can record video footage directly from three emulators. As of this recording, Kega Fusion, SNES 9X, and Visual Boy Advance are the only emulators that I know of which include a built-in AVI recorder as a feature. First up is Kega Fusion. When you open up the emulator, click the File tab on the top left. Now choose to open up whichever ROM you'd like to play. For Sega CD games, you must first click Boot Sega CD before opening an ISO. After that's done, click the Video tab. From there, click the Log AVI File option. Name your file and click the Save button. Your video will immediately begin recording. To stop the recording, go back to the Video tab and an option to stop the recording will appear. Here is some example footage. Kega Fusion is my favorite of these methods because the footage is automatically upscaled to 480p and looks gorgeous. Next up is SNES 9X. To record your Super Nintendo games, click the File tab and load your ROM. When the game is loaded, go back to the File tab and click Start AVI Recording. Name your file and click the Save button. Before the game starts recording, you will be given a few options as to which video codec and the quality of compression you'd like to record in. I personally use the Microsoft Video One codec. The higher the number of compression quality you set your recording at, the clearer your video will turn out to be. Recording at a higher compression quality may cause some lag for certain computers. After you click OK, your recording will begin. To stop recording, go back to the File tab and an option to stop the recording will appear. Here is some footage. SNES 9X records footage at around 240p, which will leave your recording moderately blurry when upscaled. I was once able to get it to near 480p, but I have no idea how I was able to accomplish that and have since reinstalled the emulator, which sent me back to 240. Finally, we look at Visual Boy Advance. I use VBA Link, but the recording options are all the same as the original version of the emulator. First, just as before, click the File tab and choose a ROM to play. Clicking the Open Game Boy option will only allow you to choose games for the original Game Boy or Game Boy Color. After that, go to the Tools tab and hover over the Record option. That will open a secondary menu. Click Start AVI Recording from there. Just like with SNES 9X, name your file and click the Save button. Before the game starts recording, you will be given a few options as to which video codec and the quality of compression you'd like to record in. The higher the number of compression quality you set your recording at, the clearer your video will turn out to be. Recording at a higher compression quality may cause some lag for certain computers. After you click OK, your recording will begin. To stop recording, go back to the Tools tab and navigate the menu as you did before. An option to stop recording will appear. Here is some footage from Visual Boy Advance. This emulator records in 144p, which will leave your footage blurry when upscaled. It's worth noting that, in my experience, the recorded footage from VBA wasn't synced with the sound. To fix the issue, I use Virtual Dub. And there you have it. Everything you need to start recording footage from these three emulators. I hope you found this tutorial helpful. I've been Skull902. Thank you for watching and have a wonderful day.